good fish, good fish, big fish, big fish. Next cast. Oh my gosh, good fish, good fish. There we go, good fish, good fish, good fish. Good fish, nice. Oh, he's going nuts, he's going nuts. Oh, that was so cool. Oh, that was awesome. Oh, it's a giant, it's a really big one. Woo! Dude. Oh, he was sitting in that log. He came up, so I watched him come out and swipe on it. I dropped it back into him and he slammed it. Oh my gosh, that was so Good morning, fellas. So there's this thing going on with all of my local schools and probably even schools in other states. I'm not sure how it works. It's called Late Start Wednesday. Now, Late Start Wednesday is the dumbest thing we've created as a people because we replaced early out Friday, or in other words, an extra two hours of fishing in the afternoon with Late Start Wednesday, which means in order to actually get some fishing in, you would have to wake up at some random time like five o'clock in the morning drive an hour to the good fishing spots to do some fishing on this beautiful river before school starts. What is going on guys? Welcome to another video. This is the Provo River here in central Utah and like I've just described to you, it's a late start Wednesday and I have about two hours to fish until I need to make the hour drive back to my school to make it in time for my yucky classes. Anyways, fishing for brown trout today. Hopefully that's what we're gonna catch. It's a beautiful day out. Let's catch some fish. All right guys, so what I'm gonna be throwing today is pretty much what I throw on any river, that being an inline spinner. First cast of the day. Woo -hoo. That's slippery. Not looking to fall today. Cool. Oh, that was awesome. Oh, it's a giant. It's a really big one. Woo! Dude. Oh, he was sitting in that log. He came up, so I watched him come out and swipe on it. I dropped it back into him and he slammed it. Oh my gosh, that was so cool. <laughs> oh, it's a big one. Oh, it's a good brown. Holy cows. <laughs> yes, dude. Holy cows. Come here, buddy. Get in the net. Get in the net. Get in the net. Oh, just barely missed him. He's going back out into the current. Oh my gosh, come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Oh my gosh, come here. Oh, that's a really big one. Yes, dude. Oh, he came out of the net. Oh, he just popped off. Come here, buddy, come here. Get back in the net. Yes, guys. <laughs> what a giant. Oh my gosh, look at that fish. That is a solid 18 inch fish right there to start the morning. Oh my goodness, guys, look at that. Look at that big old brown. Monster brown to start the morning. That is what I'm talking about, guys. Oh, and he's gone, just like that. That's why you always hold fish over the water when you're taking a picture of him. So right here, there's a branch laying in the water and I thought to myself, you know, oh, there has to be one in there. So I cast my spinner out here and I let it drift back. And I just let it drift right up underneath that stick and as I was pulling it out, he came out and just grabbed it. We're just getting started, fellas. We're 15 minutes into fishing. We still got about an hour and a half, an hour and 45 minutes left. Let's keep going, that's so sick. And that is exactly what I'm looking for this morning, a big old brown trout. Let's go. Also, there's a fly fish right over there. And uh, he just heard me screaming. He's probably, he's probably mad jealous. And I got snagged, that's no good. How did I even get snagged, bro? There we go. Got it free. And snagged again. There we go. Okay. Ooh. Got us a juicy looking spot right here. Oh, there's a bite. I just got thumped hard. That. I'm okay. Oh, this wind is 
You ruined me, dude. Dang it. Well, there goes lure number one lost. I casted. Would have been a good cast, but the wind just blew it right into that tree. Gotta love it. Let's be honest. I'm just blaming it on the wind. That was a terrible cast. Oh, 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 geez, that fish just stopped it. Holy cows, that was a decent fish. There you go, fish on. Got him. Oh, and he's gone, just a little guy. It's been a minute since my last bite, so. Cool, cool. Well, that's nice, I guess. Oh, there we go. Good fish, good fish. Big fish, big fish. Next cast. Oh my gosh, good fish, good fish. Oh my gosh, big fish. Oh my gosh, big fish. Get up that waterfall. Good fish, number two, guys. Not quite as big as the last one, but still a solid brown. Oh, come here, buddy. Come here. Oh, don't do that. Come here. Into the net, nice. Let's go, big fish number two. Had one, a little guy on right there, so I made another cast and it drifted down into that hole. And this guy slammed it, let's go. Good fish number two, baby. Yes, that is a beautiful brownie. All right guys, look at this absolutely stunning brown trout. Beautiful fins on him, let's let him go. Peace, buddy. <laughs> nice, big fish number two, fellas. We're a little under halfway done with our sesh this morning. Let's keep her going. Let's go. Oh, oh gosh, that's a slippery rock. Ow. There we go. Good fish. Good fish. Good fish. Good fish. Nice. Whoa. There we go. Oh, he's going nuts. He's going nuts. Nice. There we go. Smallest of the day, but that is still a solid fish. I will take it. All right, guys. Check out this beautiful Provo River brown trout. <laughs> there he goes. Let's go, boys. We're killing it out here. Just a little over halfway at this point. So, got about an hour left to fish. Let's keep her going. Let's go. All right, here comes an interesting obstacle. We gotta get around this shrub. That's gonna be a little challenging because the ground, as you can see, is super slippery. <laughs> so, let's see what we can do here and well, if you guys are lucky, you'll be seeing me go head first into this river here. We're going with the cave strap. Just gonna go underneath here. Oh, ow, my shin. Oh, that hurts so bad. <coughs> I swallowed something. <coughs> All right, we made it. We've emerged. All right, guys, so here's the deal. It has been an amazing morning on the river so far. Caught a lot of nice fish. I'm really satisfied. But I am starting to run out of time, and the further up river I go, the further I get from the car, which means I would have to stop fishing earlier to walk back to the car, and we don't want that. So I'm walking back to the car right now. I'm gonna drive up the canyon a ways to the next parking lot or whatever, and then I'll get out and fish there, and that'll buy us another like 20 minutes of fishing time. So anyways, that's all that's going on right now. I will see you guys when I get to the next spot. All right. Welcome to spot number two. There we go, fish on. Little guy. Like, wow, it's a baby. <laughs> Buddy. Little, little rascal, oh my goodness. I don't even need the net for him. Look at that little baby. He's so cute. There he 
There we go. Got him. Another little guy. There you go. Beautiful little brownie. Boy, is he fat. See ya. Where did all the big ones go? <laughs> oh, that, uh, there's a big one. Oh my gosh, just as I said that. Woo! Oh, come here, buddy. Oh, it's good. Dude, I don't know how I'm gonna get him through this current. Come here, buddy. Yep, come over to the slack water. There we go. It's a little bit better one. Very next cast. I'll take that. I need a net for you. Oh, come here. There we go. Woo! Let's go. All right, nice. I will take it. Not a bad little brownie. Solid. All right, there we go. Beautiful little brown trout. See you later. Nice. We got about 10 minutes left to fish, so let's make it count. All right, guys, that is gonna do it for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. As much as it brutally pains me, I have to say goodbye to the river. I can guarantee there are so many more big fish right down there for me to catch, but I have to go to English class, so I gotta bounce. But yeah, other than that, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Have a great day at school, and I will catch you guys in the next one.